thank you for joining me again um, for this huge Primark haul. Um, I say huge, it's not huge. Um, it's not like three bags huge, it's only one. Um, and a lot of it is the children's stuff, to be honest. So stick with me if you'd like to see what I've got and we'll delve right in. I hope everyone is okay. Um, I'm great and I've had a lovely day shopping. So right, diving straight in. I got the packet of five little girls vests. These are for my daughter, Matty. They were five pounds and they're just like a rainbow selection, which she thinks is really sweet and so do I. Um, so yeah, just basic stuff, which is necessary. Next, she got, um, hold on, that's mixing shots up here. That's actually from George Justa. I'll just show it you anyway, actually. Um, yeah, I nipped in there at the same time, sort of the uh, same day. So I got her a three pack of pajamas, which were only 12 pounds. Um, one of them, one of them she's already had on, um, which is a rainbow set. And the other two, I don't know if you can see them, they're just really nice, like peachy, paley pink color. And one has rainbows and clouds on. And the other one is just a star print, which are really, really lovely. So they, they look so cute on her as well. But I thought that was a bargain, 12 pounds. That is from George Asda as well, remember. It's not from Primark, so sorry, I don't know how that got in the bag. Um, sorry, we have a little surprise visit from Jags. <laughs> Just started making my vlog and um, yeah, he woke up, didn't he, from your nap? Um, he's very happy, aren't you? I'm not too sure about being on camera, but you like it, don't you? Talking to the camera, a bit crazy, mummy. <laughs> um, yeah, uh, so basically, I'm just going to um, put Jax down to play and um, I'll be right back. Right, moving on now. This is a purchase which I loved in the shop, but obviously, as you all know, if you guys have been out shopping, the changing rooms are out of bounds at the moment. So you've kind of just got to, well, I guess you guys know your style and things as well. But this I thought was really up my street. It's like a white um, cotton with these little bobbly bits on, which I think are really lovely. And it's quite low cut, or you can have it tied shut. And then it has a slight sort of um, risen bit here on the tummy, which at the moment, because I'm still not 100% happy with my figure after having uh, children, I thought it's either going to look quite flattering or I'm just going to feel like my belly's sticking out loads. Um, and the sleeves are quite like piratey as well. <laughs> I know that sounds weird, but it's what I always imagine. You know, like Jack Sparrow always has uh, shirts on in the movies where they're really poofy and like they finish at the elbow, which some people looks gorgeous on. With me, I'm a bit sort of, I'm not sure, but I bought it anyway. It was only £11 and I went for a size 10. Um, I will show you a picture of it on however I just I'm undecided still I think at the moment I'm likely to take it back only for the simple feeling that I feel frumpy in it at the moment so if I'm not going to feel comfortable in it it's never going to get worn and it's pointless me having so yeah I'll get back to you on that one but otherwise a really really pretty top and not just for summer either you could definitely layer it underneath and accessorize it with like I pictured it with like quite a few long chains whether it be silver or gold whatever your style is but I think it's really pretty with jeans or even a skirt actually you could get away with it with a skirt um, but yeah I'm just not sure it's for me next I chose this one is actually a little bit similar in some ways. It is very simple. I love white. Um, I can't always keep it clean, but I love buying it. It's kind of an off the shoulder, if you like. So it's not super short though either, which is what I like. And it's very loose around the waist area. Um, the sleeves are, I forget the name of this. Um, I know it does have a name. I'm sure a lots of you out there will know what it is. Um, but uh, it's really pretty. It's very feminine, I think. 
Um, it's a nice thick cotton, so when you're wearing it, you, it's not particularly see-through, so you can wear a, a white bra and you, you're not like, oh god, it's just totally see-through. So um, yeah, really nice. You can wear it either like that or literally across and off the shoulder. I'm quite happy with wearing it either way. I tried it on with pale jeans and wedges and I just felt like this is summer barbecue vibes. So <laughs> yeah, liked it. It would look even nicer with a tan. So I might have to um, buy a tan from a bottle and um, hopefully do a barbecue or something soon. But yeah, really nice and really chuffed with it. I got it in a size, this is a small and there's plenty of room. I'm normally a size 10. Um, I have been a 12, um, I'd probably say almost a 14 straight after having um, Jack's. But yeah, I'm, I'm naturally a 10. Used to be an eight when I looked after myself and worked out all the time. But I can honestly say at the moment, I'm only just getting back into it. So I'm a, a nice rounded 10, but I don't like things to be super tight around my tummy. Um, yeah, so this was only six pounds. So I was really pleased with that. I thought it was a real bargain. Next. Now, these are for the kids, actually. Like I said earlier on, I didn't get loads. Um, oh, actually, hold on. There is a couple more pieces for me. These are at the bottom. I just wanted a really simple, bright T-shirt because everything I wear is usually muted tones like blacks, whites, beiges, creams. Um, rust and light yellow doesn't suit me, um, but I'm, I'm usually quite tanned as well. So I like bright colors. They make me sort of feel happy and healthy. And I saw this and I loved the pink. This is, I went with the medium, which is a 12 to 14 with t-shirts. Hello, <laughs> Jax. <laughs> Sorry, Jack's in the background. Yeah, I usually go with t-shirts very baggy because I like them like slouchy t-shirts, really soft cotton um, that are just easy to wear with jeans and things like that or leggings if they're like a nice sort of longer length. Um, this was a bargain. It's one of their little ones, which was two pounds. So I just snapped that up and thought that's gonna get worn definitely. Um, you can also, was um, this olive green hoodie, which I love. I love olive green. Um, makes me feel like I've got more of a tan. Um, it just says on the front, Paris, um, and then the numbers. Um, and I got it in a medium, which is 12 to 14. Um, it was only eight pounds. Um, I got it in a medium because um, as much as I love hoodies to be huge quite often, I, I quite like to wear bras and stuff, um, sometimes I feel really like frumpy and ugh. So a medium in Primark size in this particular hoodie is still slouchy, um, but also got a little bit more shape to it. So I'm really, I really like that. It's got the like kangaroo pouch pocket on the front and the hood has this detailing just around the edge, which I really like. I think that's quite a nice it's a little effect. Um, obviously drawstring hood. Um, the hood is nice and lined as well, which is cozy. And as you all know, I'm sure, Primark hoodies are super soft inside. So yeah, really happy with that. And that will get worn a lot, <laughs> whether it be with leggings, jeans or whatever, if I'm taking the dog for a walk or the kids to the park or I just want to chill out and get snuggly at home. That's definitely going to be used. Right, okay, next now is kids stuff. So I've got, we'll start off with Matty's bits and bobs. She got these leggings, which are a two pack. So they're like a fuchsia pink with a grey heart pattern. And they're three to four years and they were only £3.80 for two. So the other ones are like a grey basic, um, but they'll go with lots of things that she already has. And basically, like Primark stuff, it's just so handy because it's so reasonably priced. You don't mind it getting ruined or, you know, even if it doesn't last long, it's only £3.80 and stuff. So that's great. <laughs> Next, I've got 
This is actually a boy's t-shirt. <laughs> Sorry, Jax, thank you. <laughs> Are you piping up, hey? This is an age three to four and it was £1.30, but I actually got it for Matty because she loved it whilst we were in there. She really liked the pink writing on it and the colour of the t-shirt. And I thought, yeah, she'd really suit that. So it just says Santa Cruz Company, West Coast. It's just like a little surfy t-shirt. So she really is happy with that. Next, we've got... saying um Jax has got I know it's coming to the end of summer um so it's probably not going to get worn however I was hoping we might get one or two more sunny days before it gets really rainy and cold um so I bought Jax this little hat it's got it's a reversible one and so it's got like a jungle theme going on this side and this side is just plain red so I thought it was really cute and it was in the sale. It was only a pound, so I couldn't leave it there. Bargain. Next, we've got some little sunnies to go with it. How cute are they? These are only a pound. And like I say, if he, he doesn't even wear them, like I just had to get them. I couldn't leave them there for that. Not sure that he's keen to keep them on as well. Tends to uh, be more interested in eating them, which I suppose is standard behaviour at his age. Next. He had this. This is probably going to be too small for Jax because he is um, growing super fast. But I just really loved it, and they didn't have his size, so I bought it anyway. It's a six to nine months, and um, he's like ten months. But I was like, I'm going to stretch it out a bit. It was only three pounds, so I love that. I love the um, like floro sort of green on it. So it's really cheerful. So he got that. Next, I got him this one, Forever Fun, which is definitely Jack's. <laughs> this is an 18 to 24 month, so it's too big, but I really liked it. Again, I couldn't find his size, so I thought I can just hold on to it until it fits him. This was only three pounds as well, so really cute, really soft as well. So that looks good. He really suits blues, so I tend to buy him a lot of like navies and petrol blues. This again is a bit big for him at the moment, but it was 50p, so I had to pick it up. Um, this is like this kind of suits Jax as well, it's kind of olivey, like he's a bit like me. We've got naturally olive skin, and like olivey greens and things, and creams and beiges seem to suit us, uh, so I'm told. <laughs> so, yeah, this is 18 to 24 months as well, and bargain at 50p, so it's quite lightweight as well. That's cute. Next, he got. Pajamas. And I want him to be all snuggly this winter. So these are, I'm sure you've all seen these pajamas. They're in like adult sizes as well as kids. But these are super cute. They're just blue and white, very, very thick, fleecy, cozy bear pajamas. <laughs> can't wait to see them in those and um, these were only £4.50 and they're 12 to 18 months so really cute can't wait to get him bathed and smelling all fresh and then put him in his little jammies and get him cozy um, next going back now from winter to summer <laughs> these shorts were literally £1.30 so if he gets a day out of them still then I'm happy with that I just thought they were really cute and couldn't leave them there so they've got like a surfy sort of pattern to them. There's those. Next, I have... Now I went a bit crazy on t-shirts for Jax just because they're like £1.30 and they're gonna get worn and I'm not too bothered if they get stained and stuff with certain dinners and whatever. So this one is Little Monster skateboarding or surfing. And it's uh, one and a half to two years, £1.30, bargain. This one, going to summery vibes. <laughs> uh, raw some dude. I'd like to say maybe he'll fit into these again next summer or early spring, but knowing Jacks, I'm quite doubtful as well. So these are, this is one and a half to two, and it's £1.30. He is a little raw some dude, obviously I'm biased. 
Next I have this little California t-shirt, good vibes only, which is definitely my mantra. And £1.30, one and a half to two years old. Next is, sorry, I'm waiting for an Amazon delivery and I keep thinking I can hear like the van outside. So I'm kind of a bit like, ooh. <laughs> and we do have a bell as well, so it's a bit crazy me worrying about that, but don't want to miss it. It's very important. Next, I have this one, which is a skateboarding T-Rex that says, rah, he looks like he's skateboarding through Hollywood. I thought that was really cute. And I think, yep, yeah, this is the last but not least, a floral yellow awesome T-shirt, which is £1.30. <laughs> so he's done pretty well. <laughs> Whilst I was out shopping, I did get a chance to just pop over to George Asta. Um, I often get the kids uh, lots of their clothes from there just because I think they're really reasonably priced and they're lovely items and they have some yeah really cool designs which I'm quite keen on. So I got Jack's, not that he needs more t-shirts as you've just seen, but <laughs> he's got a little bear t-shirt that was only 2 25 and he says grrr, which is so cute. Then he got a Mummy's Little Monkey t-shirt, again, 2.25. These are really nice quality as well. They're quite thick and um, I'm sure he'll wear them throughout autumn and stuff as well with a chunky like cardigan and stuff. Then I got him this pack of two, which I love. These were six pound for two and they're such fab quality, really thick. They're like a waffle kind of material. And um, so obviously there's like the khaki green and then the beige, which I love. Then his feet seem to grow so fast. I don't know if anyone else's kids' feet do, but I've got him a new um, set of socks. These are five pairs of dinosaur patterns. Yep, he's in the background. So you get the star pattern, stripies, gray, and turquoises. So they're lovely. I also got Matty some more pieces, which are, this is absolutely adorable. This is like a um, salmon-y, mauve -y kind of colour and it's a corduroy material little mini skirt with a little bow, two pockets, elasticated waist. Um, I actually got it in a one to one and a half year olds. She is coming up to three in November, but she's really tiny. So I think this will fit her, even if it's only for a short time, it's just gonna look better than the other sizes. That was only six pounds, so bargain. This I love, <laughs> so cute. A polka dot, thick cotton, it's like a ribbed cotton, um, little dress, which I imagine with like black tights and little sort of patent, patent black boots. Um, Sorry, Jax is just throwing my hair brush on that. So this was seven pounds and this is a three to four. It has button detailing down the front, but it doesn't actually open. So it's just like a long sleeve t-shirt dress, but thicker. So I think that's really nice for like autumn vibes. She'll look really cute in that. Then just before getting into the car, <laughs> I managed to get the kids around one more shop, which was Claire's accessories. So I picked up Matty a sort of petrol-y, well not petrol blue, but a sky blue headband and a white um, little headband, which have got the knot bow kind of things. That was a pack of two for £5.50. So they're pretty neutral, so they'll go with a lot of her outfits and she really likes to wear those. Then I also got her the selection of hair clips, which are like, like a glittery vibe. And then these ones as well, which are a bit more autumnal. And then she picked out this little um, lip salt. So it's a little creature. I can't remember what these are called, but she loves them. And you pull the top off, open it, I where do we open it? And it's like a little lip salt. She's obsessed with the makeup that I do have. So I try and keep her out of my makeup bag by buying her things like this and telling her it's her lipstick. So she's quite happy with that. Um, I can't remember how much it was, probably about 2 99 or something, but yeah, she loves it. And that is everything. My haul from Primark, George Astor, 
and Claire's accessories. So hopefully the kids are kitted out for a few months. <laughs> They're probably going to grow drastically in that time and need a, like the same again. But um, yeah, I will keep you posted on what I next purchase for the children if you're interested. And um, I hope you enjoyed this vlog. Um, I've really, uh, really enjoyed sharing it with you. Um, I love watching these kind of vlogs. Um, yeah, so if you like my videos, then um, please like and subscribe because that would be really helpful to me. Um, I really appreciate that. And yeah, hopefully see you very soon in my next vlog. Take care, lots of love. Bye.